Hi, as promised, I'd like to take you through the next of our SAP Business One 9.2 Patch Level 4 videos. Now, this one's going to be applicable specifically for those of you who are running SAP HANA. And there's a specific reason for that, which I'll explain to you as we go through. So, this new feature is what we call recommendations. How does it work? Well, if you go into sales and you open up your sales order screen, Assuming that you have the sidebar switched on, you will now have this recommendations tab. So if I click on the little chevron here that opens up my sidebar, I click here on recommendations and you'll see I've got two windows here, recommendations for this customer and customers who bought this item also bought. So what this is going to do is when you select a customer in the sales order, it's going to show you all the products that it recommends that they should buy based on previous buying patterns. And then it's also going to look at other customers in the system and it's going to make suggestions based on what those other customers bought that might be applicable for this customer. So there's some pretty, um, what's the word? I was going to say pretty complex, but yeah, why not? Let's use that word. There's some pretty complex algorithms that get run in the background on a batch process. Every so often the system runs through and it, it runs these algorithms and looks through the data and prepares these recommendations for you. And it's the power of SAP HANA that allows SAP Business One to do this. Traditionally, this kind of functionality has only been available for organizations that are running the really large enterprise solutions. But of course, that's the benefit of SAP HANA is that it unlocks the power of those kinds of features for you as a small or mid-sized business. But anyway, let's go ahead and take a look at the process. So I'm gonna call up one of my customers I'm going to pick uh, Machina Corporation just for the sake of the exercise. And so now you'll see as soon as I pick Machina, it shows me the products that um, are recommended for Machina to buy. So I can simply go through these products and say, you know what, I'm going to add this particular product to the order and then it'll bring up the next one in line. Uh, I'll, pick, I'll pick this particular product and so on and so forth. So it will show you the first X number and by the way, in my sample data, there isn't actually any um, associated customers who've purchased these other products. Um, so when I'm looking at these particular recommendations for this customer, it's not showing me any other suggestions um, based on what other customers have bought. By the way, you might see um, rattling away there in the background, there's my SAP HANA stock status that is automatically updating there for me in the background. Um, so, you know, you've got all of this functionality available to you. All you need to do is to switch it on. Now, if you're looking at your, your system and you're not seeing this sidebar, well, what you need to do is you need to go here into your administration. You need to go into your system initialization and you go into your general settings. You need to make sure that you have enabled the sidebar in the uh, windows to display the link dashboard. So what that's going to do is that is going to make that uh, additional sidebar available for you. All right. So that's the capability. If you've got any questions about that, if you've got any questions about moving to patch level four, perhaps you're running on Microsoft SQL Server and you're interested in moving to SAP HANA. Well, pick up the phone, call one of the leverage team on 1300 045 046. We'll be more than happy to talk with you and explain to you how you can take advantage of this functionality and a lot more that is unlocked for you when you move to SAP Business One version 9.2, which is powered by SAP HANA. Thanks very much.